Hey what's up everyone this is Lisa today we're super excited to bring you another powerful addition to your data management toolkit introducing the all new button field in NoCodeDB The button field allows you to add customizable buttons directly into your tables making it easy to execute predefined actions with a single click whether it's opening a URL launching a NoCodeDB form or triggering a webhook you can now accomplish more with just a single click to add a new button click on the plus icon here you'll see various options to customize your button and you can configure it to either open a url or run a webhook first let's check out the open url option you can directly input the url or create a formula for it so the url will be dynamically generated based on the data in the current record for example if i want to use these github ids to make a direct link to their profiles I'll make a formula with concat. Then let's edit the label, choose a style, change the icon, and we're done. Now when you click any of these buttons, you will be redirected to the corresponding GitHub profile. Pretty neat, right? Next, let's see how you can run a webhook with type manual trigger to send data from the current record to external services or applications. For instance, if I want to notify my team in Discord about a specific task, like when it gets delayed or completed, I can add a new button field. Select run webhook and choose an existing webhook or create a new one. In the new webhook model, you can rename the webhook add webhook url and customize the message body using the sample payload you can also check out the official nocodb documentation directly from here let's scroll down to discord webhook section copy this code and paste it into the body and edit it as required next let's test the webhook and save changes after that go ahead and change the label color icon and click save Now when you click the button you'll receive the customized message on Discord There you go Let's test it again And yes it works perfectly And if you want to tweak how the message looks you can always go back and edit the webhook to suit your needs That's it up on the new button field in NoCodeDB. Try it out today and let us know what you think about it. Make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss any super cool updates. Thanks for watching.